Well, I'm trying to figure out, really. Yeah, you be able to come. Upstairs here. I'm smoking here. Those guys. So annoying. Oh, he says he's got, he says he's got it. Um, right, yeah, exactly. Yeah. I'm gonna knock the scope down. Yes. I don't know. Yo what's up guys, this is Wintergore with a quick look at the crossbow from Battlefield 3. Uh, basically this crossbow has four different tire types which are the standard bar bolt, high explosive bolt, scan bolt and the balance bolt. The standard bar bolt is basically a close quarters bolt which has a quite significant drop on it so uh, you won't be able to fire it that far. However it does do a high amount of damage at close range. So you want to try and aim for the upper chest to head with this one. I believe you can also get an instant kill on the stomach sometimes. Basically you'll want to use this one either hip firing, which is extremely accurate for a hip fire weapon. It's almost in the center of the screen, so it's very, very good for whipping around and firing. However, some of the drawbacks for this crossbow, which must be noted, are it's extremely long reload times and also switching between bolts has an extremely long amount of time compared to other weapons. Also, it's inability to pull off concurrent double kills or even triple kills. Uh, what I mean by that is not your average double kill where you just lance through two people. That can be obviously still pulled off. However, killing one enemy and then immediately moving on to another one who might be stood next to him is extremely difficult to do with a crossbow as it only fires one bolt and then it has a long reload time. The second type of bolt is the high explosive bolt. This high explosive bolt has uh, C4 strapped to the front of it. I know what you're thinking. Oh, sweet. I'll be able to blow people up. But it's actually not very good on infantry unless you get a direct hit with it. Its main use is for either making an opening that you want to rush through, for example in a wall, or bringing down a wall on top of an enemy, which is uh, always quite fun to do on those uh, inner city maps here, and also on the new aftermath maps. It'll be quite fun to use. I can't wait to see all of these uh, destruction kills that you guys are getting with them. And the third type of bolt is called a scan bolt. This bolt is basically used for if you're going to uh, spot some enemies for your team. For example, if uh, you notice some enemies are flanking around maybe on the left, trying to get around your team on a rush game mode, you might want to tag them for everyone on the map, get them to come up there, and your team can then go ahead and destroy them. The fourth type of bolt is called the balance bolt. This one is used for mainly sniping people. However, if you have a sniper rifle, you might as well just use that, as it has a lot less drop and it's a lot easier to aim. Uh, the balance bolt has a uh, significantly less drop compared to the other three types of bolt, uh, which is a huge bonus. Um, so you want to go ahead and use this one over long range, or if you want to pull off an accurate shot on a guy who might be stood still. Uh, as always, you'll need to lead your enemies and also lead the drop on this crossbow. I hope you guys enjoy using the crossbow in the new expansion, Aftermath, for Battlefield 3. Uh, let me know if you guys pull off any really cool kills, I've already seen a few already out there, such as uh, AC-130 kills and a few jet kills. I'm not sure if the jet kill I saw was actually legitimate, because it looked like it could have been a bit of a setup. If you're trying to go for them type of kills, just keep in mind the things I said in this brief guide. And if you guys want to take part in the events which you saw at the beginning and you're about to see at the end here, where we uh, run set weapon battles, cool game modes like the mortar run, then you want to go ahead and take part in the Go Olympics by subscribing to my channel and follow me on Twitter. Uh, thanks for watching guys, I've been your commentator today, Wintergore, and I'll see you guys next time. Oh wait. Oh shit. We should be out a lot, like through the... Yeah. Kill me. Behind you. Yeah, exactly. I fucking torch you! Torch you came back from 92 to 98.